Well, I got some good news and I got some bad news. Once again, I am strangely off. Well, yes, offline. I'm strangely offline. But um, by the time I do get back online, hopefully, sometime tonight, probably later on, maybe. Um, I will be uploading this as well as the last video. <coughs> As well as a few other videos that I also plan to do. So I'm going to do a really quick check. Yes. Turn on my screen recorder. And, um. Turn that on. Turn this up. Because I'm not. I'm not sure if it's AOL. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not going to question. Anyway, um. While I am doing this, um, I plan to, I have something in my hand which I found, um, a few weeks back. And, of course, this is a, um, this is somewhat of a horror-based game, which somewhat is, somewhat is like the polar opposite of The Goonies 2. But, um, uh, it, it's just really a clusterfuck of a, of a game. And it's not like I covered it. But I own a physical copy of it. Behold, what I hold in my hand. Dr. Chaos. Yes, it's Dr. Chaos. Even though, even though it, it's like an old... Yes, it's from an old video store I really used to go to uh, when I was younger. I used to actually go to this place called Omni Video. It was around the corner from my house. And, um... Yes, I actually bought this from Omni Video. Now, what is so interesting about Dr. Chaos, or... Or as my Japanese side would say, chaos. Yes, Dr. Chaos. It's still chaos. I'm just saying it's Japanese. What's so interesting about Dr. Chaos is it feels like the Goonies 2, but plays like Legacy of the Wizard. Now, what I mean by that is, well, Legacy of the Wizard really doesn't tell you where to go or how you should go about doing it. But... And I'm saying, and I'm saying this, I'm saying this profusely because I actually played this game on my Nintendo, my physical NES. The thing about this game is, it, it, it's like this: you don't know where you're going, and you need a map just like you need it for Goonies 2. You have to go through doors just like Goonies 2, and once you get a radar! You can find parts of a dimensional weapon that can destroy the greatest evil ever known and possibly save your brother. Kind of like Goonies 2, except you're saving your friends. As well as your brother. And you get all sorts of different weapons. Like you get a knife and, um... A gun and somewhat of a of um grenade that can actually downright kill your ass for no apparent reason. Yeah, a broken ass grenade. Cause you know, why not? It's so fun. But in any case, um. No, what's going on here is that, you know, you're trying to actually understand why you're actually playing this game. Nobody knows why you're playing this game. Why would you put up with it? And I like how Big Fatty Plus says it. It's like Goonies 2, except that the game that 
wants to be like Goonies 2, except it doesn't have a PhD. Oh, very true. He said this last night in stream, by the way. But still, in any case... Yeah, this is a little review of the game. And like I said, well... The thing is, it's somewhat of the pl it, it's somewhat from a player perspective. You can either finish the game in 30 minutes, depending on how fast you how fast you can actually plow through the game, or it could take you an hour, depending on how fast you can get through the game. And I mean, pro people they can actually get through the game like 30 minutes, just because they know where to go. And they don't, and they don't mess around. They just go like, boom, 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 like A, B, C, D, E, F, G. However, if you're one of those players that want to be sure you know where you're going, it will take you longer. You need to know where you're going. Plus, you're playing it for bottom map. It will take you longer. You will go A, B, C, D. They do have some jump scares, but you know they're. Not quite like, you know, Left 4 Dead type standards, you know. It's not like, I should say Left 4 Dead. I should say more like Resident Evil standards. It doesn't have that kind of, that kind of stuff like jump scares, Resident Evil style. It's just mainly, you know, be careful because you're going through this, and one wrong step, you might end up dead. So, like I said before, this game, Dr. Chaos, I've never beaten this game because A, I don't know why I got this game to begin with. No, really, I, I do not know why I got this game to begin with. I possibly will never know why I got this game to begin with. Because for some for some odd reason, it just won't tell me why I got this game. Well, the thing here is, considering that some of you have seen it done, you know, some of you may have seen a long play of it, or a let's play of it. And if you've seen a long play or a let's play of it, then you should take notes on how it's done. However, and I do mean however, like I said, it all counts on how the player is. If you're a pro and you know how to get through the game, it could take you 30 minutes. If you're not, it'll take you longer. But I wouldn't sweat it. Um, like I said, what I'll probably do is if I am doing this right now, I am actually going to do this live. And that is... Unplug said modem... Like so. Unplug it back in. Like so. I'm actually doing this live. It's strange. As soon as I turn on my computer, it just turned off. So I'm just re. So I'm just resetting it. So therefore, plugs in. So, like I said, what I'm going to do is I'll most likely throw this on. Uh, I will throw this video and my other video onto my hard drive and most of you guys will see this sometime tonight like I mentioned in my last video I will have something something planned as far as LPs go, something short just because I haven't done a LP in a while I should really do something about it so other than that, you know, all I'm going to do is do something short for tonight, for the next couple of days, and with that, I'm going to, you know, 
still work on my other LPs and such. But, uh, yeah. Dr. Chaos. Oh, uh, Dr. Chaos. Yes, Dr. Chaos. This game will put you on a recalcitrant trip. Or maybe not. But anyway, this game that I just reviewed, it is one of those games which you can either love it or hate it. Because it is the son of the legacy of the wizard and Goonies 2 if they ever made babies. This be the end result. But in any case, guys, I will see you soon with some Let's Play goodness. I am the Tenkaichi of gaming, Pookie Izzy 7, and take care and goodbye.